die for them to miss me. I don't wanna die for them to miss me. I don't wanna die for them to miss me. They wish and 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 on me. Hey SDA, so this upcoming week is Red Ribbon Week, and uh, what's going on with that is it's a week to really be aware of the um, the stuff going on with drug abuse and alcohol abuse. So um. PALS and ASB are partnering, partnering together to um, really try and promote awareness about substance abuse. So, there'll be activities going on every day. Keep your eyes open. Um, in terms of the bulletin, on Monday, May 14th, there is a robotics meeting from 3.15 to 3.45 p.m. in room 111. Then there is extended hours tutoring. And for Spanish, that's from 3.30 to 5 p.m. And uh, that's in the Mustang Commons. So you can see the student news for that. So uh, for Monday's activity, you can pick up a red ribbon or a bracelet before school at any of the parking lots. There'll be tables there um, just to show your support and start off the week. For Tuesday, May 15th, there is a blood drive, and that is from 8 to 1 p.m. in the gym. Uh, you can sign up for that in the ASB room. Then there's math tutoring from 3.15 to 4.15 p.m. in the Flex Lab. There's also extended hours tutoring, and that's for science from 3.30 to 5 p.m. in the Mustang Commons. Finally, there's JV Baseball, uh, CCA versus SDA at 3.30. That's Tuesday. And then uh, for Red Ribbon Day, you can come down to the bell tower and you'll be able to see um, this really interesting demo about what happens about DUI and the dangers of it. And uh, we can have a discussion about what you can do to prevent it. It'll be cool. On Wednesday, May 16th, it's the last day to buy a prom ticket at 3.20 p.m. The math tutoring happens in the flex lab from 3.15 to 4.15. There's extended hours tutoring, tutoring from, uh, but there's a room change today. It's from the social science, 3.30 to 5 p.m., room 42. On Wednesday, there is going to be a, um, there's going to be wear red, and then you should, then you should get a, a piece of candy at any of the three parking lots for wearing red. And on Thursday, May 17th, there's math tutoring from 315 to 415 in the Flex Lab. The Japanese National Honor Society, the JNHS, is, has peer tutoring in the, at 315 to 430 p.m. in room 124. And there's extended hours tutoring in um, English from 330 to 5 o'clock p.m in the Mustang Commons, and you can see the student news for that. On Thursday, May 17th, uh, uh, the PALS and ASB is gonna be coming around to uh, homerooms if you wanna do a Kahoot. And on Friday, May 18th, there's a Junior Java. Um, and on uh, the PAC on Friday, there's going to be a signed pledge banner. Um, and on Saturday, May 16th, May 19th, there's a uh, prom from 7.30 to 11 p.m. at the San Diego, so you should come to that. In other news, Thank have you, you bought so your much. yearbook? Supplies are limited, so buy now. Um, be a stallion and go stag. Be a stallion, go stag if you and a bunch of other SDA students um, want to go in a group to the SDA prom. Meet outside the ticket entrance of the San Diego Zoo. Miss Baggins is going to be waiting there for you, so you can go meet up with all of them and go in as a big group. We Connect Wednesdays. Join us on Wednesday, May 23rd for Reconnect Wednesday Lunch Club in Miss Duck's room. If you don't know where to eat at lunch, come join. Everyone's welcome, staff included. Thanks. <laughs> Be positive, positive preventive, preventive, and, and proactive, proactive about DUI and substance abuse. Yeah. <laughs> come take a selfie with Rob the Red Ribbon on Friday at the PAC while you're signing your pledge and DM the PALS Insta page to be featured, or get an extra piece of candy. So, uh, back again for another edition of The Bryce is Right. Uh, this week we're featuring a Red Ribbon Week. So, uh, here's the question uh, for this week. This is only good for Monday. It's only good during homeroom. And you have to give the answer this time to Miss Leonard. 
She's in room 120. So Miss Leonard 120 during homeroom Monday, that's your call. And we're talking Monday, May 14th. Here's the question. Red Ribbon Week is all about making good choices, uh, not choosing drugs or alcohol. So what if I convinced two students to make good choices and to be drug and alcohol free? And what if those two students each convinced two other students to be drug and alcohol free? And what if that pattern continues so there's five times telling two students to make a drug and alcohol free choice? So I'm the first time myself telling two kids to be drug and alcohol free. What if that happens a total of five times? How many total students, including myself, would be making that choice to be drug and alcohol free? Tell that answer to Miss Leonard, room 120, May 14th, homeroom, first come, first winner, as always. Happy Red Ribbon Week. I don't wanna die for them to miss me. I don't wanna die for them to miss me. I don't wanna die for them to miss me.